two incredible matchups on January 1st on ESPN. And they have been buzzing all morning here in Austin as Edwards gets the easy layup. Here's Gonzalez. As it knocked away by Edwards, gets to Harmon. Still plenty of time to operate. Harmon fading away. She got it. Which she said was really hard for her to take watching that game. It was a fairly close game that Connecticut ended up winning. Mule in the mid-range gets it to go, plus the foul. Who has even more of a load to carry. Off to Edwards. Edwards spinning inside and finishing, plus the foul. Aaliyah Edwards off to a terrific start this afternoon. Getting Aaliyah Edwards the ball 15 feet and letting her go to work. The other thing we've seen them. Mule. Hands to Beckers. Nine to shoot. Beckers leans and hits. Paige Beckers with her first bucket of the afternoon. And Beckers keeping her from getting any good looks. Here's Muhammad cradling and finishing. Vic Schaefer has been delighted. It's Muhammad who slid into the starting lineup and has done a wonderful job. Gaston getting close to returning. Beckers connects really, on a three. Really nice screen by Aaliyah Edwards, and Beckers read it well. We're going to have to ask Gina Cross. She's the one who picked it up. Harmino left alone, lays it in. Great cut. Great cut. She made Nika Buell bite. Nika Mule. With this smaller lineup, it's now Paige Beckers who is on Booker. Here's Harmon. Floats it to Muhammad, left alone, and knocks down the jumper. Off to Booker, she'll fire. Around and off, long rebound. Here's Arnold, has speed. Arnold dashing inside, gets blocked by Booker. And controlled for Texas. The attack by Arnold to the rim. Wow, what a great block. Booker just goes straight up and down, keeps her hands up, just the flick of the wrist at the end of... Here's Brady facing up and hitting the jumper. Here's Muhammad left alone again and able to hit again. Filthy in and out. Here's Harmon weaving, taking, and hitting. Rory Harmon having an afternoon. Got the three belt ball well this season is to hit it. That's her sweet. Who, when you talk to her, I mean, she's just magnetic with her personality and the way she breaks down the game as Nika Mule banks in a deep two. Here's Arnold. Off to Brady. Bounce inside, Edwards another layup, and Aliyah Edwards up to nine points. You just can't run them over. Oh, right. In life, you could be moving. Yes. And in basketball as well, right. but, but not <laughs> when you're going to set a screen. Right. Booker finishes plus the foul. She is 6'1". She is strong. She can elevate. Was Arnold in her land? Aaliyah Moore into the game, loses the handle. Edwards alone with a loose basketball, and the easy two. Wow, that was risky. Aaliyah Moore into the game, loses the handle. Edwards alone with a loose basketball, and the easy two. Wow, that was risky. Here's Booker. Little jumper, too strong. Brady tips it, then saves it underneath the hoop to Texas. The flip up no good for Moore. A chance for five is good. Texas is just longer and hoppier and able to get those extra opportunities. Is hoppier a word? Yeah. You know what I mean? I do. Brady. Yeah, it was interesting just hearing her process as she thinks through. If I make this pass now, you see him open, but I know this player's about to dig. As Booker hits another smooth jump. Incredible 31-point performance in their loss to Kansas. That was a heck of a game to watch. Hey, our friends Sue Bird and Jason Sudeikis were courtside of that game. They were rooting for... I'm just glad it's not a team I was on. <laughs> <laughs> Here's Booker. Bounces to the corner. Gonzalez connects on a three. Watch the hedge, oh, she rejects the screen. Shane fakes the three, takes the two, knocks it down. Booker's jumper is smooth. It's really smooth. 25 shots in this game. Well, it's his defense that yeah. prevented her from doing so. Here's Harmon into the paint, elevates, and gets it to go. They are averaging 
a plus 13 per game in the turnover margin. Here's Muhammad going back door, laying it in off the delivery from Harmon. We showed you the stat earlier as Edwards gets inside of Jones and finishes. Part of that is a reflection of the Their tough yeah. strength of schedule that they play every year. Here's Booker behind the bat, dips inside. That is a pro move for Madison Booker. I mean, 6-1, again, we've talked about her frame here behind the back. Definitely step, just step through. Almost threw it away. Brady was just able to stay in the front court. Here's Beckers. Beckers shovels it up and in. All right, so what do we got at first? We got one thing, and then now we got the chicken salad, Ryan Rucco in the <laughs> floater. because. That... And while she's incredibly capable of it, she would rather get her teammates involved. Booker. Wow. <laughs> get basketball. So the first time, she, on the exact same move, she got up short on the three. Rebound gobbled up by Muhammad. Couldn't get the put back to drop. And then Edwards directs it to Beckers, who has it knocked away. Harmon waits, dishes, and the finish. Arnold finds Beckers. Clean look is good. Maybe the best look Beckers has had all afternoon. And of course, she drills it. Facing up, bodying in, and it's stripped. Here comes Beckers. Paige Beckers, the no-look dime, and Edwards lays it in. Couldn't finish it, got to the rim. Now Booker, the pull-up is true. 17 turnovers for Connecticut. Here's Harmon. She got it on a three, and a nice response from Texas. Man, look at the hot Wow, tonight. look at Paige this. Beckers. Muhammad takes it away. Harmon flips it ahead. Gonzalez. Lays it in, beating the clock to the fourth quarter we go. Mina Muhammad, the 6'4 big, able to help get the steal, leading to two easy ones the other way. Turnover is the story of the game. In the break about this Texas team. As we begin the fourth quarter, Nika Mule gets a shot up finally and hits the three. I mean, you, you're watching them today, and this has been their real first test of this early part of the season and say, all right, what's their weakness? Well, coming into the game, the <laughs> ice by Booker, right to left. I mean, again, here, face up. I mean, just the poise, the quick jab step, right to left, no one's been able to stop. 0-10 oh, all time, Arnold nearly came up with a steal. Instead, Harmon gets space, jitters into the pen, floats it in. Some key members of their starting lineup, their rotation, but so Beckers is still coming off a major knee injury as Moore lays it in. 17 point Texas lead. Edwards flashes free and lays it in. UCLA plays that day. Against Florida State. And we got Connecticut against North Carolina. Arnold lays it in, tough finish. Get some decent looks the other way. You wonder how long Paige Beckers will stay on the bench. Harmon, Arnold, comes in with a steal as Harmon was directing traffic. Shade gets ahead and lays it in. Game long, getting steals and scores the other way. Well, KK Arnold says, we're going to give you a little of your... That silky smooth jumper off the dribble. Here's Shade on a three. She got it. 19 turnovers for Connecticut. Muhammad lays it in. Good position on the block, and Harmon found it. Will Connecticut get another chance as good as the one they just had? Edwards knocks in the jumper. Here's Harmon. Dumps it in. Jones fading and hooking it home. Two possessions in a row with great looks from the Texas Bigs. Edwards, nice little give and go with Mule on the finish. That was a spect. Under four minutes to go. Here's Samuel's jumper. It's good. Connecticut has cut it to seven. Eight point game, Connecticut basketball. Still a lot of time left. Back door, Samuels gets free and lays it in. She has played like it this afternoon. 
Back door, Arnold lays it in. Harmon gives it up to Booker. Three to shoot, Booker, the fadeaway, off the mark, rebound, knocked around, Texas has it, and the putback.